video about how to disassemble the CON70 converter, the new CON70 converter. So you see this is a, these are two CON70 converters. The silver one is the old one, the black one is the new one. So the differences are, you can see visual, uh, the new one has a little bit, little squares here, and it has like these striations, probably for better ink flow, so the ink wouldn't stick to the walls, and it also has an uh, agitator. Unlike the old one, which was a clean body, right? Okay, so the, the old one, uh, the disassembly was quite easy. Basically, it, it wasn't easy, but like it was like relatively easier. Uh, you could just simply screw it very, very hard with a lot of force, and you could actually unscrew it and you could move then all this body out. But the problem was that there's like this inner reservoir which is inside. It's very hard to get to it. You, there are videos online how to do it. Basically, uh, there's like two notches. You need to insert some sort of metal part and then twist it and it unscrews it. It's, it's pretty hard, actually. It's pretty hard. It is doable, but it is quite hard, quite complicated. Mostly, probably, you will end up just unscrewing this part and it's probably close enough for uh, mm, clean. Uh, okay. The black one, the new one, is actually relatively harder, but on the other hand, it's maybe not harder. Uh, I'll, I will show you in a moment what's, what are the differences. Basically, uh, now you can't unscrew it. You're gonna twist it, twist it, twist it, twist it, and it will never end. The trick is, now it's a very important part, I need to find the logo. Okay, the logo, logo, logo is here, right? And then you take it, uh, it's already loosened up, right? So this is just for demonstration purposes. And then you actually need to move it sideways. You can't pull it out. You need to move it sideways uh, to the logo, sideways, you see? And it actually, it requires a lot of force. It's it's probably not intended to remove it. It's definitely a hack, but it's possible. You can move it very, very, very a lot of force, and it, it actually can move it out, right? So this is a cover, and you can remove a mechanism. So you can see there are these, like, notches, right? So basically the idea is that if you move it sideways, we actually you bend them down a little bit, so and then you can remove it. Okay, this is the mechanism. Now, th that was the hardest part, and now it's only the easy part left, right? So this is uh, pretty similar, but actually this mechanism is actually better than an old CON70. Why? Because you can actually, this rod, you can pull out the rod, no problems. You know, this agitator, this thing, easy. And now this part is actually made only from four, four pieces, much easier. So basically there is this thing, the black one, the part which like a plunger. So basically just pull it out, right? And here it is. It just pulls it very easily. You know, this is a some sort of cross hole where that metal rod goes in. Right? And very easy. Just I just pulled it out. No problems. And okay, this is a spring. And spring has also this sort of metal ring spacer, so uh, you should be careful not to lose it, right? Because spring may have spring in power and can fly away, right? So this is a this is single piece, right? And this is like the inner res reservoir, right? And it's actually much easier to clean it relatively to the old one because you can just take a Q-tip and it's clean, right? In comparison to the, you see, the old one, which is like, oh, screws everywhere, like, um, so it was pretty, pretty hard. Okay, so that's all. Okay, now if you want to uh, put it back, so you can see this is a spring, and uh, where's the metal ring? Oh, here it is. Yes, a metal ring. I pull this thing back on. OK, 
is seen, right? Back on, it's on. Uh, the plunger. Uh, I don't know, this metal rod, the agitator on a shorter end, right? Shorter end is actually, there's this like square hole. You can put it on. It's actually like sideways. Maybe, maybe you shouldn't be putting it on, but oh, it's actually quite easy, right? So that's all. And then you take our body and then you put it in. Maybe you could supply silicone grease if you want to that part. And that's perfect, right? Then you take the cap. That's the biggest problem is that there's no screws, it's friction fit. Like, so every time you need to, can you see it? So every time you're gonna need to push it very, very hard. And like, you see how big the gap is. Like we need to push it, push it, push it. Like, yeah, maybe like, it's to bend them. Yeah, so, and this is like not fully, I think I, yeah, I think there's like a little bit of gap, a little bit of play. I don't know, will it work? Yeah, it should work, but yeah, I think I put it on.